Now, the debate over taxes and welfare is heating up. Korea's well, uh, ruling party says it's time to reconsider whether to keep some free welfare programs. The main opposition party says the welfare system is not the major issues, but is rather the current tax system that favours the rich. Our Lee ji reports. More welfare without tax hikes, a promise that once sounded too good to be true, is now stirring up debate between the two rival parties. When President Park Geun-hye took office, she promised to expand welfare without increasing taxes by cutting down on unnecessary projects and plugging tax loopholes. However, the recent hike in cigarette prices and revised income tax codes resulted in public criticism that such policies were hurting ordinary salaried workers. Both parties agree that providing more welfare without increasing taxes just won't work, but the two differ on how to fix the problem. The ruling Saenuri Party is calling for a new welfare system that works for Korea. The ruling party's chief policymaker Won Yoo Chol says the government needs to reconsider the provision of free school lunches and free childcare programs. He also said instead of increasing taxes, the government should try to provide necessary welfare according to the tax it collects. The party's new floor leader, Yoo Seung Min, however, says increasing taxes is not out of the picture yet, and the party should discuss ways to provide at least some free welfare programs. The main opposition New Politics Alliance for Democracy thinks the problem lies with the tax system itself, not on expanded welfare. The main opposition's floor leader, Woo Yoong Geun, said Parliament should set up a special committee to revise the current tax system. The party also believes that various tax benefits for the rich and the president's pro-business policies are what's causing the country's widened social polarization and the ballooning household debt. With a little more than a year left until the general elections, the two rival camps are under pressure to find a way to appease an angry public that's criticizing the government for squeezing money out of average wage earners. Lee Jun, Arirang News.